So far we've been using donor cartridges, donor shells, where we take an old game like this and we basically gut it, strip it down, scrub it down. This isn't finished being cleaned, but strip it all down and then use that to make our games. But we don't always want to do that. So what we've been working on is a replacement. The replacement, right now we're working on a 3D printed version of it, has gone in steps. Here's the first, see this is, this right here is the PCB that we use. So the first step was we were, I printed up to, trying to get the exact placement of the PCB. So I kept working through various layouts to get the right placement. Each one's a little bit more. Keep going. I was printing it at high speed, very thin, just to get it done quicker. Slowly getting down there. This one, I believe, is when I ran out of out of the PLA and had to get it another rollout. But now, see, I've thickened it up, so we're getting there. Now, this is the one that ran out because they're not tall enough. But now we're down to where now the cartridge actually sits in the place where I want it to sit. So we keep building up. Now I started adding strengthening in. Make it better. This one I increased the height of the tab some too. Finally got down to here and I've made some changes after this, but this is the really solid finished version of it. This can lock in no problem. Then as then I approached the front cover, the front of it, and I started working on it too. Till we finally got to this one here. This is the second to last finished version of the back. Don't ignore all this. This is just my 3D printer. I want to print real quick like that. There's a couple things that has some tabs that are getting printed on the next version. And this goes in here, sits in there nice and tightly. Then here's the front. The front's nice and solid. This is the one actually. This one has tabs on it and it has a center post to push down on the cartridge here. I have yet to figure out how I'm going to hold it together. I have to sand it. When I print a fine print, it shouldn't have to sand it, but I might have to sand it to get better contact. Adjust some things, make sure these things are lining up. But I'm getting to where I want it to be. It's a very solid cartridge. Reminiscent of the Clico cartridge, but I was using the Microfun cartridge as more of my basis for it. It's very stiff. The edges aren't thin, so it should hold its shape no problem. So that's what we're getting at.